this? How do you feel about it? I feel great. Do you? You probably feel a lot greater than I do since you can hear. Yeah, I can. And I feel like I just have cotton balls stuffed in my ears. You gotta spend the money. Get you something off. Alright, so today Matthew bought a new toy. And so now he has to fix his socks. Yeah. We're really too close. Are we too close? But it'll work. Yeah. We're too close, he says. But Not really. It'll work. We'll just see where it hits. To the left. Is that at the very bottom? But is the box moving? There's the problem. That's what I said to the left. And so there's the little screw. And he adjusts it. Let's try that. Yeah. better. Still to the left a little. That's better. What say you? These earplugs kind of suck. What kind were they? The Safari Land. Gosh. That one weren't right too. Hmm? That last one did. There's a big red circle. Getting closer. Where are we at now? He had one to the left and one to the right. That's just me. <laughs> All over, bro. Like here to here to here, just me. You can try it if you want. Yeah. I can try. I'll try the rest of this magazine. Okay. Uh, Start at another. Put one right in the center. Put, actually, put put one here and then put one here. That's good. what it does for you it'll probably do completely different for me and so on and so forth mine and Sam's weren't the same when we shot ours Where'd they go to? What? Where'd they go? Right in my oh, way. Okay, I see. You're shooting on the... Yeah. Damn. Must have dropped my tool. There it is. Drop that. 
So what do you think about it so far? How does it feel? It's good. It has more... The war axis is higher. You can tell. It feels snappier when you shoot it than a Glock or even that Taurus. Because even though this is milled out, just the, the design, it's just really top heavy. Mm. You can, it's a big, it's noticeable over something I'm used to shooting. Yeah. Like a Glock. You'll say what I'm talking about. So shoot that same dot. It should be pretty damn close. Yeah, I should have brought my loader. We got some cheapy cheap ammo today. This was a $9.99 Cabela special. <laughs> Good ammo. Shot thousands of rounds of it. Yeah, these are the Safari Land, like noise canceling. Um, Is it working or not? <laughs> no, not very well. I mean, the, there's no difference between these and regular earplugs. Huh. Regular earplugs may actually may actually work better. The only observable difference between that right now is the, the recoil just hits differently and the trigger feels super short. Like the way it breaks, it feels like there's almost no pre-travel when there's live ammo and it feels like, it feels way lighter than probably the seven, six or seven pounds that it is. It's probably not even five and a half, six pounds. It's probably heavier, but it's pretty, it feels light. There's 16, that was the rest of that box. Just put the dot halt dead center of that red dot. <clears throat> well, it's pretty well right on. Hold on a minute. Let's you saw it. you shot two right right beside each other. Yeah. Just keep One. holding it. Keep holding it where you're shooting it. Let's you're try doing, about. You, do about you're putting five pretty more. good. Five or six more. It's, it should be pretty close though. Yeah, it's, I'm gonna start pretty... over there on the fresh one. They didn't take much to sight one in. That's good. Yeah, I would say it's pretty well. I can drop it down another hair, but I don't really think it needs it. For fast acquisition, it's pretty close. It's, yeah, that's pretty good. It's not made to be precision. It's made to be out of the holster, fast, shot on target. So, I think it accomplishes that goal. You feel what I'm talking about, though? The yeah, recoil? it does flip. Mm -hmm. You can't really prevent it, either. I was trying to with my grip but it's, you can't really it's the design of it it's just it's more muzzle flip that's wonderful there's either one more in the chamber or getting off on. back there's one more in the chamber <clears throat> I'm gonna go for the empty part of that white sticker square yeah you're a little low you were low yeah there you go you get to load the mag this time <laughs> My thumb's already sore. Those thoughts. I like it. It's a good shooting gun. The trigger's great. It's got a great trigger. Um, the grip's awesome, but it just... I'm so used to shooting Glocks that it's hard to keep the muzzle down and shoot fast. It's easier to shoot faster with a Glock than it is with this. Yeah. Just because... I mean, the dot, plenty bright. I was worried about it being a cheaper red dot than a Trigicon, but... I had to turn it down like four notches out here, even with the sunlight we got. It was left. so bright. It was too bright. Did we just so, got one mag out here? Yeah, I forgot my other one. So in full sunlight, you got plenty of brightness, which is generally a problem with these. But I had to turn it down about five. It's got about 15 settings. That's the other thing that sucks is this versus like a tritium powered one. Is these, if you're carrying this gun like on a vacation trip or something. This is your concealed carry. In the middle of the day, if you're walking around, you gotta make sure you turn it up. And then when it gets dark, you gotta make sure to remember to pull your gun out and turn your sight down or you pull it out. It's just gonna be 
Yeah, you be blinded. A wall of red, you won't yeah. be able to see shit through it. I think that flipping's just going to be a matter of getting used to it. It's a great gun, though. Yeah. I Obviously, like no lot. malfunctions. Um, I do like the sights. They give you a lot to grab to rack them. You know, yeah. you can, it's easier just to grab this big old thing or the front. Here, I'll start a new. I'll start a new dot. A new dot. Your turn. Is it time to build a new dot? It's your turn to shoot now. Is it my turn, really? It is. No, I'm not shooting. Yeah, you are. No. Mm -hmm. Got a full magazine. Your go. Look how it's getting all burnt. It's too big for my hands. Like, I can just tell you right now, it's way too big for my hands. I like it a lot. The color's growing on me. I definitely like the bronze better than the coyote tan. I think if I ordered the subcompact frame, the black will look good with the bronze. I wondered what color you were gonna get. Black. It's a. It's only a two finger grip, so it's. So like it'll fit my hand. Twenty six, and it's a small circumference. Good. So it's like two good. millimeters more narrow than this. Good. The mosquitoes are circling y'all. See them. All right. You shooting or no? Not right now. I'm making a video. I will in a minute. New dot? Yep. Trying to keep the muzzle down. That last time I was really trying. I was gripping the shit out of it. Not bad. No. One left. Actually, yeah. I think. Uno mas. Great gun. All right. Great gun. I'm glad you're happy with it. Lots of wear. Already. Look at that. The top any, of the barrel. <laughs> any final words? Before I come to the end of this almost 13 minute video on Friday the 13th. Still not as good as Glock. Still not as good as Glock, really? Are you serious? Yep. Yell, any final words? I like it. I like it better. Well, I like it better than the stock Glock. I'll say that. Than but I'd, I'd have a hard time choosing between it and the like a Glock with a good trigger. But I mean, I like it. It's, it's good. I really like the trigger. Yeah. So that's that. There you have it.